Hey guys, it's Faye. Today we're going to be making a lava lamp. So what you're going to need is a funnel, half a cup of water, a bottle of water that you guys like or a container that you guys think is really good looking. We need some canola oil and we need some effervescent tablets. Uh, effervescent just means it's popping. Actually it means it's bubbly, but it's close. So we're going to take this. Luckily I've already put the half a cup of water in for you guys. You know, save us time. And you're going to take this. This is an oil um, funnel. Get a regular one for the kitchen. You know, you use what your mama gave you and mom handed me the oil funnel. So, let's see here. We're going to take the canola oil. Mom and dads are going to probably help you with this with a better funnel. So we're going to pour it all through the container, all in it. We're going to watch it sink. You see how I'm tilting it a little bit? That really helps. Make sure you got it tight, all right, though? If this falls, no one's going to be happy. Keep pouring, keep pouring. Oh. I actually sat on, cho sat on chocolate today. I don't know if that's happened before. I sat on an M&M &M that I was eating and then it fell and then I sat on it again and then fell asleep. It was not good for my clothes, but oh well. That's why I changed. And we got it almost all the way. And almost there. And beautiful job to whoever poured it. Obviously, I did a beautiful job, so good job to me. Clean that out. Make sure you got. Make sure you clean your funnel so super well. I mean, really, really give it a good clean. Or might have didn't fit. All right. Next up, we're gonna take some food coloring. I got blue because blue is my favorite color. We're gonna pour. Oh, before I start. You guys can notice the canola oil and the water are separating. That's because density, density comes into play. What's density? It means water is going to be heavier than oil. So you see the water fall to the bottom and you see the oil rise up because they're different um, weights and you see they don't interact. So learned about density right there. And then we're going to pour the water, sorry, the coloring into the water and the oil. Nice. It's going to get really just a lot of amounts of stuff. You probably should use less, but, you know, we're having fun here. Actually, I'm just going to, you know, just, oh, whoops, it's okay. That's what happens when you go overboard. All right, next up, you take the effervescent tablets, open them up. If you want to break them up, it actually makes the reaction happen a little faster because it has less of a giant thing to dissolve and go through the water and such. So drop those babies in, drop them in, hurry, 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 and close the lid. And check that thing out. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I'm thinking I used way too much food coloring because I got too excited so definitely fix that but look at this baby wow that's pretty cool I said it was a lava lamp just just put a little flashlight behind you and we'll call it we'll call it a day this thing's awesome <laughs> wow oh they're still at the bottom okay there's still stuff at the bottom so this is going to keep going for a long time, actually. And because I got a nice bottle, you know, it looks a little looks a little cooler, honestly. You can use a water bottle, but it's a little harder to pour, to be honest. That thing's awesome. Okay, so for yours, I would suggest a lot less food coloring and a different color, but this is pretty cool. There you go.